All right, guys, I don't know if you're ready. I don't know if you're ready for this, but we're going to do a Wuwa Freaky tier list. And you know what? This is probably going to be a really fast video because there's basically no men in this game. Let's just be honest. Let's just be honest with ourselves. Like, they have not released a new man. All we have is Sheng Liao recently. That's like, you know, he was free. They they gave that they gave that to us. They gave that to us. They gave a free male character to us. But let, let's be honest, there's not very many. You know what I just realized? I realized I forgot to put the names of the tiers. Let me just do that real quick. One hour later. All right, there we go. As you can see, we got the Destroy Me top tier, the Submissive top, the Power bottom, and the Be Destroyed bottom <gasps> tier. And then we have Nope, and uh, I'm just gonna say it right now, there is one character that's gonna go into the Nope tier, and I'm sure you can probably guess who that is. Uh, they have a certain, certain white hair, certain lion-esque look to them. Um, yeah, you guessed it, it's Ling Yang. <laughs> There he goes. Uh, we're not rating that. Definitely not. First up, we have Zhang Li Yao. Zhang Li Yao. This is difficult. I... Oh, I don't know. I feel like this is going to be such a controversial opinion. But Zhang Li Yao... He, okay, first off, he's either this... Or he's kind of giving me this a little bit. I don't know why. I'm going to put him there. I feel like I'm going to get so many people yelling at me for that. I might change my mind, but for now, he's a submissive top. Okay, he's a submissive top. And now we got, who the hell is that again? Morteffi. That, yeah, Morteffi. I'm going to be honest. I have absolutely no idea. I have to think about that one for a hot minute. A few moments later. A power bottom? You know what? He's a power bottom. <laughs> You know what, Morteffi? He's a power bottom. You hear that? Do you guys agree with that? Morteffi is a power bottom? I mean... I mean... I kind of see it. I kind of see it. No, 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 no. Okay, wait. Morteffi is a submissive top. Yes. Yes. Yes, that's correct. That's correct. Morteffi is a submissive top. And I don't think Shang Li Yao is a top. I don't. I can't see that. I can't see that anymore. Wait, you know what I forgot? I forgot the verse here. <gasps> Oh my god, one second. One eternity later. Okay, I got the first tier. You know what? I kind of think he goes there. I Well, why is he so hard to rate? Zhang Li Yao, he's a verse. He's a verse. He's definitely a bottom. Let's just be honest with ourselves. <laughs> Zhang Li Yao, bottom. Uh, but he's a bottom. Okay, bottom, bottom, bottom. And now we have Alto. And Alto is the verse king, honestly. He is the verse king. And he I see verse for him 100 percent I also put Sampo in this tier in my Honkai Star Rail tier list. And Alto and Sampo to me kind of give like the same energy. Alto just he just gives that energy, don't you agree? Alto is a verse king. He's a verse king. Am I wrong? Or am I right? Because I think I'm right about that. Okay, I think I'm correct about that one. And now we have uh, the most bottom of bottoms of bottoms that ever existed in the entire world. Male rover. The bottom. Mega, mega bottom. Super bottom. The most bottom of MCs in any gacha game. <laughs> Let's be honest. Male rover, there's only one correct choice for him. Only one correct choice. He is the biggest bottom that has ever existed. And I don't know what they're doing when they get paired up together because they're both bottoms, but... Yeah, that's where they both belong, because they are the most bottomy of bottoms in this entire game. And now we have uh, Mr. Scar here, Mr. Onigiri. We need Scarcy back. Give us Scarcy. <laughs> um, I think Scar would go into probably the verse as well. I kind of just see that for him. I feel like he just gives that energy as well. He's kind of like a Sampo personality, but like obviously more evil. <laughs> and that's why we love him. He would be verse for sure. For sure, he would be verse. Um, and now we have Kalcharo, uh, the Sephiroth lookalike. And Kalcharo is definitely giving me top. I don't think he's anything else. Calcharo is 100% top. He, I mean, have you guys seen his body? Like, damn, he's chiseled. And now we have Gion. And can you believe that we're already down to four men? Four male characters left. That's how little male characters we have in this game. Isn't that sad? Kuro Games, please feed us, feed us more. We need more. <laughs> I know we just got a free male character, but I want more. I'm craving more. I think we're all craving more. But anyways, Gion. Gion, I... He, okay, listen listen to me on this one. Hear me out. Hear me out on this one, okay? I know everybody would probably put Gion in the top tier. And I don't entirely disagree, okay? I don't entirely disagree. But 
Here's my logic. I'm going to put him in the submissive top tier. And the reason I'm going to do that is because he's very gentle and he's very caring. And I feel like he would let the other man take control. Maybe. Or maybe that's just my head. <laughs> maybe that's just my head cannon. I don't know. But I'm going to put him there. Okay. Don't come for me. Gion's submissive top. All right. He's letting the power bottoms do all the work. That might be a little Delulu, but that's okay. Uh, anyways, we have Yan Wu. And Yan Wu to me... I feel like would either be a power bottom or just a top. You know what? Just to confuse some of you people, I'm going to put him in power bottom. You heard me. I'm going to put him in power bottom just to confuse you guys. And you know what? Maybe that's my Delulu headcanon, but that's where I'm going to put him. Okay. Power bottom Yan Wu. Power bottom Yan Wu. Chant with me. Power bottom Yan Wu. Power bottom Yan Wu. And that's a fact. And now we have Yan or Yan. Yan? Yan? I don't know how to say his name, honestly. He is the trainer guy. I know he's not a playable character, but like, I mean, he might as well be. Look, like, he's got such a good design. And Yan, to me, is definitely a top. Like, uh, yeah. <laughs> I don't think anybody would be able to argue with that. He is top 1000%. Yan Wu is top. You know what? He's, he's like the most toppy of top in this entire game, and he's not even a playable character, but that's okay because we're going to petition for him to be playable, okay? We have been. We have all been wishing for him to be playable. And we have one character left who is also not a playable character, but hopefully they will be in the future. Uh, Geshu Lin. I know everybody wants him, and I want him too. Kuro, they need to give us him. Give us Geshu Lin now. I beg. We all beg. We all want Geshu Lin. And Geshu Lin, to me, I don't really know. I feel like Geshu Lin would be a bottom. <laughs> you know what? Just to make this whole list equal, we're going to put him in power bottom. This is a cursed list. And I feel like there's going to be very, very many comments about how inaccurate and incorrect this list is. But maybe this is my delusions talking. Maybe this is what I have headcanoned in my mind. But this is this is what I see. OK, this is what I see. You know, we got Yan and the Destroy Me tier with Calcharo, which I feel like is very correct. I feel like that's very correct. And then we have Mortefi and Gion and the Submissive Top, which I feel like is probably not correct, but I can't really think of anything for Mortefi. But for the sake of the tears, I'm going to keep Mortefi and Submissive Top. And then Verse King, I feel like this is very correct. Alto and Scar. Yeah, I see that. I see that for them. I think that's correct. And then Power Bottom, which probably is not correct at all. But we need somebody to fill the slot. So Yanwu, that is your that's your job right now. And Gishulin, that's also your job right now. So <laughs> we need someone to fill the slots. And then this one is a very correct tier. I don't know who's going to argue with this. I don't think anybody could argue with this. Uh, Shang Li Yao and Mail Rover in the bottom tier, like literally 100%. There's, there's just like no other tier for them. Like that's just not going to happen. That's just not going to happen. If you put them anywhere else, you're delusional. Okay, let's be real. You're delusional if you put them anywhere else. I feel like the only other tier you could put them in is maybe verse, but like 99.999999% bottom. And yeah, that's the tier. That's the tier. This was a short one because we have a lack of male characters. Let's just be real. This was a short one because there's literally nobody to rate. Let's be honest. And hopefully in the future, Wuwa will continue to give us some peak male designs because their male designs are pretty good. As always, if you enjoyed this video, I would appreciate if you subscribed and followed me on my other socials and maybe join the Discord if you want. You know, we got we get pretty freaky in there. We get pretty freaky over on Twitch too. Honestly, we get freaky everywhere. But yes, I really appreciate you guys guys watching and if you stayed through the whole video congratulations what are you doing honestly go do something productive because this is not productive but i appreciate it nonetheless no but honestly i really do appreciate you being here and i really hope you enjoyed the video and as always take care of yourselves and i'll see you in the next video goodbye